winner from the Powerball jackpot over the weekend. That means that jackpot even larger. That story kicking off today's trending stories. Here's a look at our hot topics brought to you by Walton Arts Center. Okay, well, the new jackpot is worth $1.155 billion. Ooh. All right. The next time the drawing is going to happen is actually today. Okay. I just found out actually they do Powerball three times a week, which I should know because we've been reading these each time. Yes. But they do it on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Saturdays, Saturday. okay, right? So if there's no winner today, then another drawing on Wednesday. Here's something interesting. The odds of winning the Powerball jackpot are one in 292.2 million. The overall odds of winning a prize are one in 24.9 million. So the question is, are you feeling lucky enough to play? Hey, it's worth a shot. I you think know? so, absolutely. It's worth a shot. Yes, I'm excited to get to this next story live from New York. <laughs> it's the return of Saturday Night Live. Yes, after last season was cut short because of the writer's strike, the long-running sketch comedy show will premiere season 49 this coming Saturday, October the 14th. Kicking off the new season is former cast member Pete Davidson, who will serve as host. Ice Spice is going to be the first musical guest of the season. Okay. And then the following week, Bad Bunny will pull double duty as host <gasps> and musical oh, guest. Oh, now y'all know KWA Today's yes. Crystal Martinez loves her some Bad Bunny. I wonder yes. if she knows. I, that's She's got to be excited about it. I wonder <laughs> if she'll stay up late for that. I know late nights are hard, but it is yeah. a Saturday. It's on the weekend, so maybe... Um, so it's going to be great. Yeah. That'll be his hosting debut, Bad Bunnies, yeah. there. Yeah, and the entire cast from season 48 is going to return along with one new addition, and that is Chloe Trost, who's okay. joining the cast nice. of Best to Know for season 49. All right, well, move over, Travis and Jason, and oh. that is because there's another member of the Kelsey clan that is grabbing the spotlight. It's their mom, Donna. Yeah. She is the superstar of the family. She recently stopped by the Today Show where she told the team, you know, it kind of feels like she's in an alternative universe, of course. Uh, she, uh, her sons, Travis and Jason, they faced off in the Super Bowl last year when the Chiefs played the Eagles. The Chiefs did win. Yeah. Um, and, of course, they asked her about what it was like to meet Taylor Swift. So she did confirm that she got to meet her and said that the meeting was okay. <laughs> That's a very mom answer. Uh, um, and it was like, well, did Travis kind of warn you not to say anything? And she said, it's not so much a warning. It's just his personal life. Right. And she's better than me. Because as a mom, I would have been like, let me tell y'all the uh, yeah. tea. I'm going to, yes. <laughs> I'm telling you everything. Yes. Um, no, but I love this. Um, they seem like a really, really fun family. So yeah. shout out to Mama Donna. Yeah, way to go, Mama Donna. I know. And both of those teams are having successful years so far. Yeah. You know, just a little bit into the season. But they're both looking good. So maybe they're going to meet in the Super Bowl again this we'll year. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. White Claw has developed a new nail polish product. So the Hard Seltzer Company, you're going to know that Hard Seltzer Company. It's collaborating with Nails Inc. with a new Claw Saver set. The company's created polish that matches the colors of White Claw seltzers oh. and has protective and hardening biotin and retinol in it. The set contains four nail polish bottles and a, quote, Claw Saver tool that opens a can. <laughs> nice. Right? That's so you'll chip your nails. That's right. You can't chip your nails on those cans anymore. The colors they're going to come in is Black Cherry Bliss, Mango Tango, Natural Lime, and Love Very Blackberry. Okay, well I have not actually tried White Claw, but I don't mind a little color coordination going on. My nails plus my seltzer. Yes, yeah, so a little seltzer, a little save your nails. I love it. Yeah, yeah, go for it. Well, I love this next story. Some towns have really fun traditions. Check this out. Over the weekend, a community in Michigan celebrate, celebrated Platter Day. <laughs> yes. It's all the rage in the community. The town of Houghton is out to break a world record for the most people wearing plaid in one day. Wow, that's a lot of plaid. The original Guinness world record for the most plaid wearers gathered together is 1,359. Now, once the numbers come back certified, the new record for the most people wearing plaid in one place will be 1,700. And 45 kudos to the people of this town because you figure everybody has plaid. Everybody. Yes. Yes, I love it. I love it. I, it's interesting that most of them are wearing that. I forgot what the pattern is called when you have the red and the black squares. There's a name for that, but oh. a lot of them are wearing that color. Yeah. Oh, buffalo, buffalo plaid. Buffalo plaid. That's okay, yeah. it. Yes, thank okay. you. 